and welcome Aries. Let's take a look at your cards. Be sure to just take what resonates for you and leave the rest. I hope everyone is doing well. Let's take a look at your first card and message here. And it is about patience. It's about slowing down. Maybe changing your attitude and clearing your mind. So you will know if this resonates in some area of your life because things have been really chaotic or busy. You've had a lot going on mentally or emotionally and there could be some frustration around having to be patient. A situation may not be moving as fast as you would like, but slowing down the pace or changing your mind or attitude, clearing your headspace is uh, perhaps what is called for. Is there a celebration that you foresee coming up? Perhaps you are in a completion phase in some respect, in some area of your life, and you know that there is this feeling of reward for effort. And maybe you are feeling that you are ready to bring new and exciting things into your life. The Fool. So this is about having courage. Having courage to embrace change. Taking risks and being adventurous. And so perhaps you know in your heart of hearts that there's a change that you're wanting to implement. And you know it involves facing a fear or the unknown and taking a calculated risk, perhaps. But there's excitement behind this as well. There's excitement and enthusiasm and you're kind of, you feel it. You're, you might be ready for this new adventure in your life. A new phase to happen in your life. A new cycle to begin. Perhaps there is physical travel. The plane can indicate that there is a journey, a travel, um, a travel that's happening. A journey may be planned and it might be physical, but it might also be metaphorically as well. And your understanding that with this journey, whether it's physical or metaphorical, it will become more full. The blue whale, unity, mastery and magnificence, resonance. There's a togetherness. And this may mean for you that you're starting to see things come together in your life, come together easily in a magnificent way. There might be a union, a contract, a marriage, an agreement that you're making with someone. You're feeling like you're on the same page. There's a resonance. There's a togetherness. A connection. The giant panda. Innocence. Perhaps seeing things in a more innocent or pure way. Also bringing gentleness rather than harsh words or harsh, harsh actions. That may be important as well. To bring harmony and balance into your home life, a relationship. Your work life, perhaps. How does this resonate for you? Resourcefulness, determination. There is something that you're having to be resourceful about, having to be very determined. You're having to push procrastination to the side so you can move forward in the way that's best for you. Perseverance. So where in your life are you having to have perseverance? Something that has been ongoing for a long time. And you're just taking it one step at a time and you're persevering through. Perhaps you're starting to understand that the blessings are about to flow and this is meant to be. There is a sense here of you 
being so persistent with a particular thing, with this thing, whatever this is in your life, you're being so persistent because you understand the blessings are coming and it is meant to be. Perception, focus, fear and action. And so this very much ties into the full card where you're having courage, even though there is fear or the unknown in front of you, you are taking a bit of a risk. Perhaps there is a focus, a clear and sharp focus that is needed. There is a shift that's happening in your life and you will know it if this card resonates, of course, you will know what this shift is about. It is right below the full, so it's about taking courage and moving forward, being a bit adventurous and maybe taking some risks. A shift happening so an alignment can happen, so something that you've been wanting to move toward can actually come into your life and we have unity so again there's that message of coming together with someone or unity seeing eye to eye a commitment also travel here with the world it's right below the plane preservation are you needing to preserve your energy your thoughts your mind your emotions from someone or a situation. Perhaps you're taking action in alignment with preservation. Reaction. Has there been an event where you're very reactive or you've reacted to something in either a positive or negative or neutral way, but whatever reaction that has happened that seems to be coming back, seems to be, you seem to be talking about this again or thinking about it. It's connected to unity, agreements, seeing eye to eye with someone. So there's comfort, there is serenity, comfort, balance. And there is a sense of knowing that there is a time of need. You perhaps are feeling you're in a time of need and maybe there is help that you're seeking for your heart to heal or for you to physically heal or for healing to happen in some way in your life, for comfort to be established. Again, we have that message of patience going back to this very first card. You may be finding your dreams are blooming more rapidly than you than you even realize. But they still need nurturing and they still need patience. Prioritize. So this is about the focus going back to this shark card here. Focus, action. Focus on your highest priorities. Get organized, get motivated. And counselor. So perhaps this is the energy that was coming through with comfort, in need of help, healing. Perhaps you know that you are a natural counselor and that many people are in fact benefiting from your guidance, your reassurance. So this could be your energy. It might also be connected into having to have patience. Don't give up. This is a card of perseverance. Perhaps you are protecting what you've created for yourself. And again, we have that message of courage and believing in yourself. Now, things in a certain way may not have turned out the way that you had hoped. You might not be seeing them positive in a situation, but you don't want to be crying over spilled milk either. Of 
So a relationship, a friendship or romantic relationship, you're seeing is continuing to grow closer. And forgiveness might be part of your journey at the moment. And you might be noticing that something can happen, a change can happen and a positive resolution to a conflict is is here. Missing an opportunity, perhaps you feel that this has happened or maybe you are afraid of missing an opportunity or not making the right choice. Discontentment or boredom in some way, maybe in your work life or in a relationship. But you are being prompted to open your eyes to possibilities. So the two of fire is a partnership, union, an agreement, working together with someone in a positive way. And you have come into your own. And perhaps new partnerships or contracts are something in your life important at the moment. And you understand it's there is positive movement forward for you in a certain situation. There may in fact be the end of a difficult situation you're, you're expecting or you're experiencing. And perhaps you are being encouraged to embrace change and expect things to get better now. And a very specific message here. You may be recovering from an addiction or recovering from hurt, suffering, disappointment, recovering from something that has impacted your life in a big way. It's been wonderful to read for you today. Take care, stay blessed, and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye for now.